Hey guys, MRA here once again. Just thought I'd share some new stuff with you guys real quick. Just a really quick video. Some updates to my Dexter Morgan custom figure. Um, basically a quick revisit. Uh, thanks to my buddy Mike Echo out there. He did a video recently and he uh, basically told us about this really great syringe made available by Robbie the Painter. Let me see if I can get this to focus. Focus, motherfuck! That's what that's what uh, Mike Echo says. He says, he says motherfuck! So I'm not saying the bad word, I'm saying his version of it. But there you go. There's a syringe, again by Robbie the Painter from the Sideshow Freaks forums. Ugh. Okay. Getting myself tongue twisted there. So just really amazing fine detail. I don't know if my camera is capturing that, but you can see the little notches on the, uh, the tube there. And if you're wondering, the syringe, it's not really hard. It's, let me see, it's actually like a... I can't keep this thing focused on there. Unfortunately, let me see. Can I get to focus again? Focus, focus. Oh, man. Okay, there we go. Anyways, it's like a hair. So it's actually a really soft piece. So you don't have to be careful about uh, poking yourself. But you gotta be careful not to, you know, damage it still. It is just a really delicate piece. Really great work of art. And again, thanks to Mike for the uh, tips on the gloves. I had different gloves on them previously. And uh, these are basically the Red Skull gloves, which seem to be popular these days for a lot of custom figures. So there is that for my uh, Dexter Morgan custom figure. Another quick update. This was for my Denny Kim um, Detective Mills. I uh, finally got... Let me see if I can get the light better on him. I got this uh, police vest for him, bulletproof vest. And it was like three fifty on eBay, and uh, in the movie he had that at the end of the movie, and it's pretty accurate, you know, down to the two straps down here and the color. It's a really dark blue, looks almost black. So if you watch the end of the film, he had that. So I'm just glad I was able to find that and add that to my uh, Detective Mills to make him a little more movie accurate to the end of the film. And what else is going on? You guys saw my Roz last night. So there he is again. I didn't really show how it looks with the mask on. I mean, there's a way to put it on, but basically, you know, he'll look something like... Uh, let me see if I can do this a little better. Something like that with the mask on. Just to give you guys a rough idea. Is that focusing? It's hard for me to see. Anyways, there's that. And, uh, still working on my Rick Grimes. You can kind of see him back there. I don't really want to do a full reveal yet. Just because I'm not satisfied with the paint job. I'm having a hard time doing the eyes. Um, oh, and I recently got this in. This is a, uh, Blondie by Rain Man. Let me see. So, you know, just the head sculpt. One of his older uh, head sculpts from back in the day. But I do want to eventually have a Blondie figure. And uh, if anything, I have a really good head sculpt to start with. He also comes with his uh, little cigarette that you can put in his mouth. So eventually, if I can find, you know, the rest of the outfit, you know, I'll try to bash that or... Uh, see what I can do. So that's it guys, just some quick updates. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for viewing. Bye.